A Wake County jury has sentenced Nate Holding to life in prison without parole for murdering his in-laws in 2014. The jury deliberated for about four hours before reaching a unanimous decision. CBS North Carolina's Robert Richardson is live at the Wake County Justice Center where the sentencing hearing ended late this afternoon. Robert. Well, Sean and Sharon, the jury convicted Nate Holden on Monday for murdering his estranged wife's parents, Sylvester and Anglia Taylor, in 2014. Now, they began those deliberations late last Thursday, then into Friday, and continuing into Monday before reaching that guilty verdict. But the deliberations on how to punish him took just four hours. The jurors were unanimous in deciding there were enough mitigating factors to sentence him to life instead of death. Between the jury announcing its decision and the judge formally issuing the sentence, some of the victim's family members made statements before the court, and Sylvester Taylor's son directly addressed Holden and the life sentence at the end of his comments. Being that you have a chance to live more of your life, I know that they will want you to get your heart right with God. That's the whole reason you're still here. Because if God saw intent for you to be gone, you would already be gone. The judge sentenced Holden to two consecutive life sentences for the murders, and Holden also received 20 to 25 years for the attempted murder of his estranged wife, who survived the shootings. Now, coming up at six, you'll hear from Anglia Taylor's sisters about the emptiness of the past few years living without her loved ones. Reporting live at the Wake County Justice Center, Robert Richardson, CBS North Carolina. Robert, thank you.